We are back in the cab and the work has continued. Mama, look. And it's a family affair today. The sun is more shaded. We decided to just bring our drawing and our, our book. We're reading <gasps> We're reading Lillian Thrasher. Done. Which is a fantastic biography. And so I am doing the reading while the people are working. Okay, pull that edge on top of the last board. It is an absolutely beautiful day here. Kids are having lots of fun because they bought six walkie-talkies. They pooled their money and bought six walkie-talkies, and they are really just having a great time with them. They came with earpieces. Yep, I will put a link in the description box. Everybody pooled their money. Well, not everybody, but most people. And so now we're pretty cool. Six, six walkie-talkies. So lots of fun. And they work great. So why are we putting plastic up? Because the metal roof that we're going to put on will um, condensate in the change, in drastic change of the temperature. Okay, so there could be condensation from the roof because it's metal. Right. Jason actually went this morning. No, was that yesterday? Yesterday. Yeah. Yesterday he picked up roofing. Got a great deal on it. I'll have him show you that in a little bit, tell you more about it. But yeah, and we have actually today, we actually received a call about some random roofing that is available for us for free. So that's pretty amazing, but it actually might be big enough that we can use it for our big house. So we'll see. We'll tell you more about all that later, but right now I'm going to get back to reading a little bit of Lillian Thrasher way through the throng to get to Lillian. And I am Camille. Who is thinking? This English accent that made Lillian yeah. want to laugh. Yes, she replied, and this is my sister Jenny Thrasher. So exciting to be here. If you can help us get our trunks and go through customs and immigration, we'll be on our way. Indeed, Camille replied. I know exactly how to get through all of this. Follow me. What is his word? Were bolts of cloth and all manner of other items. Everywhere, people swarmed around. <coughs> They overflowed from narrow alleys that passed through streets onto the avenue that the threesome was riding along. The air was damp and pungent, and the mid-morning sun... Well, we had to pause the action for a little bit of real-life consequences for some kids that were acting up. That's how it goes, isn't it? So now James and I are hanging out down here. What did you want me to write on your wood? Hmm? What did you want me to write there, Mr. James? <laughs> Let me see your your little piece. So you found this on the ground. Jeremiah found it for you? Yeah. And what did you want it to say? Um, James Gracie. We did not know that James knew his last name, but he said, right, James Crakey. He knew and that. Jeremiah. I knew that. Uh-huh. What is yours? You have one too, don't you? Wow, you guys are going to need a good bath tonight. You've been having fun today. No, bye. Wowzers. No, bye. Yeah, they're pretty messy, aren't they? And you found a stick. That's Jason's sword. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Lots of fun down here. Lots of fun. Some kids went back on their bikes for bike rides. Didn't they? Oh, you went up. You want Mama to hold you again? Lydia's not feeling well today. Okay, come here, Mama hold you. Well, it's a new day, and Jason has been hard at work. Yeah, More wood. <laughs> Are you tired of talking wood. about wood to everybody? No way. It excites me. Wait, where'd this come from? That is Mr. Dan's. My Man. friend Dan's. My only friend Dan's uh, table he's going to make. Yeah. Um, so I told him that while yeah. the guy was here making siding for us, that I'd ask him to put um, a straight edge on one side. Okay. Since his machine would easily do that. Right. So this is what we're going to do for the siding. It's kind of windy here. I hope they can hear us. Yep. We had a question about what we were doing for siding. And this is it. Right, exactly. So we're going to take these boards. He's going to mill them up and um, basically make planks out of them. Similar to this. So basically like this, only not four inches. Um, so then they would come over here and basically make um, about five more passes on this. I mean, it would be the whole log, right? But that's what you do. So he makes a pass, you peel it off, makes it, he, he cranks it down another three quarter inch or whatever, makes another pass. And then you, you can see out of a tree like this, you can get a lot of board 
out of there. And so we're gonna make it um, as wide as the tree allows us to. It's pretty incredible. Size yep. of these. And the idea, so here, let's, I wanna show the, the sapwood and the heartwood. So there's this huge misconception if you buy cedar at the uh, lumber yard that you're getting a quality rot resistant uh, board and it's only slightly better than pine because typically what you're getting there is this lighter colored wood. Oh, you're which not is getting heart. No, oh. if you get a heart wood, which is more valuable and harder to get here, look at the, if you look at the, here's the actual base of a tree. Wow. You can see that there, you lose a lot of, or you lose a fair amount of wood when you go for the heart wood. And so true heartwood cedar is rot resistant, meaning like it will outlast your, you, your grandkids, whatever. Wow. And so um, I honestly don't care so much about getting just the heartwood, but we will get a lot of it. So he's coming here to he mill is. it right on yeah. site. So what we're going to do is we're going to drop these. Well, I'm going to put some boards this way, some uh, logs, so small logs this way so that I can roll them easily to his trailer. Because essentially his trailer is somewhat like this one in length. And he's got these two forks that are hydraulically um, actuated or levered or moved, whatever, where he comes in and he'll um, will roll a log on top of it. It'll pull him up onto his machine, if you will. And then we lock it down in place and start slabbing it out. When is he coming to do that? I haven't negotiated that yet. Oh, I can't so wait. So I have to make sure I have enough wood for him to do it. Yay! Yay. Back with the